Ten seconds. Thornwell feeds it to Hakevichus with a two-handed jam. A sloppy, fast pace. Dozier, the lob for Hakevichus, overshoots it. They want to establish Jacobs and Mitchell on the interior. Offensive foul on that. Than a team that's improved, but a little bit of early game jitters from both sides. Herrera feeds it inside to Hakevichus. Good feed into the post. Marcus Stroman today. Stroman took a shot into the forehead, had stitches just above his eye. Did not practice yesterday for the Gamecocks. And oh, another run by the other team. Mackey feeds it into Hakevichus. Post up. His hands on the basketball, knocked out the three from the corner. Big bucket. And a window on the bench since the 17 and a half minute mark of the first half with two early fouls. Hakevich is tough up and under. They notice. Possession looked like disaster, but points for South Carolina. Now a foul inside. He does have lofty goals. He'd like to see this team in the final four. By bonus, Hakevich is Shoot over the top of them. Dump down to Hakevich Got to the low block. That one spins. Get the fender when the ball goes into the post for Georgia Tech. At Kevishis, who had 30 in the first round game. Up a one seed Gamecocks. Hands full with a four seeded Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets. Though in the last 10 games, has he gotten into double figures? He was an SEC player of the week, and certainly a big reason why this program has turned aside. Travel, trying to establish a post game. And then, of course, the 1 3 has them really big. You're low, your hands are up and big, and your voice is loud. And that's what they want. At Kevishis, that is way off the mark. Didn't have his. Kevishis on the floor for South Carolina. Baseline cut. Bad communication. And now South Carolina, Justin Mackey doesn't play a ton. He's picking up some minutes. F. Richard Cross, Dane Bradshaw, Laura Rutledge with you from Colonial Life Arena in Colonial. Did that pretty well. P.J. Dozier has it knocked away. Ends up in the hands of Hakevich. Just away. Notice wide open. The self-imposed sanctions earlier in the week coming off. In Carolina enter the ball to their bigs as they did right there. Dozier on the wing, gets inside, gets the first degree of difficulty the Missouri Tigers have on their shots. I'm not sure they've gotten many better shots this game. They're just making his feet. He can't keep up with a guy like Wes Clark. A feed inside, and then they kick it out. Thornwell wide open. He plays. He plays so hard. Here's one Gamecocks, eight and eight Missouri Tigers. Inside to Hakevichus. Zone was what really got him back in this game. Hakevichus in the high post. Little dump down. Lamonis. That little hook shot gets a nice touch. Here's Thornwell. At Kevishis, fouled and counted. Process of learning for him, and he's excited to get going with the Gamecocks. Notice tries a three. Pereira comes. They'll have to hit the road, but they won't know where they're going until about 1.32 o'clock in the morning today. Uh, they're already staying. Mitchell gets it to go. Yeah. South Carolina overextends on their denied defense, which creates the driving in. Nitinus will try another three ball. That one's short. At Kevishis. Slows the run of Missouri. Tigers, though, go right back at it on the offense. Rosberg picks up his dribble and then turns it over. Against this zone, he's a deadly three-point shooter for the Tigers. Maria drives in. And the team's RPI, second year in a row, the number one strength of schedule in non-conference play. As we see. Jacobs. Big physical post presence for the Jackets. That won't drop. Working on notice. 
Lammers out to Stevens. The Tech out rebounding South Carolina 13 to 9. Jacob spins into a double team and trap. Boy, Coach Martin got to think about getting Carrera out of there for the half with two fouls. Mitchell. I don't know if that was a. The all time leader. Clark guarded by Thornwell, thought about the three. Rosberg, nice touch in the college play. Your youth and inexperience get exposed at that position more than any other on the court. Clark kicks it out. Isabel on the way for three. Clark guarded by Dozier. It's a screen and makes those again on halftime in Columbia. South Carolina raced out to a 15-0 start to the season, lost for the first time on the road and getting into and said that he wanted to be coached by a guy like Frank Martin that would push him. Dude, his resiliency, I can't imagine what he and his family are going through, but they certainly have the right attitude about it. Combined to score 63 or 52% of Georgia Tech's points. Terrence Phillips, the point guard for Missouri. Phillips, Clark, right shoot. And a travel. Working against Dozier. Gets inside in traffic, and he draws the foul. Was without per year for the entire first half, and he's the leading scorer on this team. Inside and out of Kaichiness after, after a tough couple of ball games. Phillips for three. Turning them into points. Three on the way. Phillips. Right. And South Carolina really aggressive down. Pushes. Kept alive by Georgia's hunt to Jacobs. That won't go. Tapped around. Notice doing a really good job of keeping Marcus Georgia's hunt in front of him. Nice move by Jack. But Thornwell should have just thrown an inner to him. He stops and pops. 54%. They've also knocked home six of nine from behind the arc. Reverse layup goes to Boston College. High arching three by Smith. Record for victories. Now trying to set an overall record and right out of the gates. Jackson. Wild and out of control at times, but you'd rather have to slow somebody down than speed them up. He's got great energy. On two. Hills. Mackey threw it right into the hands of Isabel. He goes right at Mackey, overshoots it. Court. P.J. Dozier has done a terrific job this year. His assist to turnover ratio is down. A 29 assists to 40 turnovers coming into this game. Quietly pushed the lead back out to nine. Ace the rebound. West Clark kicks it off. Three on the way. Clark's three off the ball. He's going to be a really good player for South Carolina. Smith again, this time no good. At Kevish's three in transition. Boy, they go right into their half court offense. Stevens won't go. Mitchell, good rebound. Had it not have any advantage on the glass right now. In and out for Smith at Kevish's. Smith can't shoot. That one was off the mark from the get go. Smith wide open. Boy, South Carolina really fortunate there. High off the window. Won't go, but there's...